welcome to the other 167 dearly beloved this season of february here in india we are about to step into spring time the trees around are shedding their leaves which was there from the past year and new leaves and new life is springing out as i was looking at this and i a scripture came alive in my spirit i'm reading to you from the berian study bible that is psalm 138 verses 8 onwards the lord will fulfill his purpose for me o lord your loving devotion endures for ever do not abandon the work of your hands here david recalls all of the things that is happening in his life and his hap- and the circumstances that is prevailing around him there were circumstances that was against what god had purposed in the life of david god had promised that he will be the king of israel but his father in law was chasing him and he was hiding in one location and moving to another place so on and so forth as i read the previous verse if i walk in the midst of trouble you preserve me from the anger of my foes you extend your hand and your right hand saves me dear brother and sister have you passed by in your life where the decisions you have made or the circumstances around you or the people around you have made you to do things which was not right and you feel that you have gone away from the plans of god but here comes an encouragement to you that the purposes of god he intends to see that it is completed in your life god wants his purposes to be completed in your life in spite of what has happened around you the lord is able to work out things for good only for those who love him is what the scripture says another scripture paul writes in philippians chapter 1 verses 6 being confident of this thing that he who began a good work in you will carry it on to the completion until the day of Christ Jesus today is a word that comes to you and me from the word of god that in spite of all of those mistakes that have happened in our lives because of our own choices and because of what has been imposed upon us the lord is able to work things out for good he is able to perfect that which concerns you and me but the precondition is this he works things for good for them that love him today let's check our hearts do we love him with all of our heart our being and our soul and our body let's offer ourselves as a living sacrifice to the lord god almighty let's look to the lord in prayer heavenly father Thank you Lord for this privilege of knowing you and the assurance that we have that you who has begun a good work in us will complete it until the day of Jesus Christ. We pray that you will touch each one of us so that we will run the race that has been set before us looking unto you the author and finisher of our faith. In Jesus name we pray. Amen. And amen. I'd encourage you to like our channel. subscribe it share it with your friends god bless you